Hello guys and welcome to this React.js tutorial. First of all I want to thank you for all the support you have shown me. I already have like 150 views on my channel and that is pretty crazy. Okay so now let's get on to the video. So in this video I will be explaining the state of React.js components. So the state is basically a JavaScript object that is that stores dynamic data for the component. So let's set up the state. So you go above the render method and you do constructor constructor and then you do super you call the super method which uh, you have to call it because you extend the react component and there's more stuff to that but it's not really important and then you do the stop state and you set it to an empty object or, or whenever you want to put a state you put it here so for example I'm just going to put number and I'm going to set it to zero Okay, so now that we've set up the state, now let's see how we can display the state to the user. So in our return, let's create a div, and then we we'll just say this dot state. So this is how you get the data. So you do this dot state dot number, and then that should get the number, the value of number, and display it on the website. So as you can see, if I refresh, zero, because we have set it to zero. So now, how do I change the state? So when you create a state, React automatically gives you a function that changes the state. It's called set state. So I'm just going to make a button and then just say click. And then on click of this button, so when the user clicks on the button, I want to do an arrow function and then just do this dot set state. So this is the function to change the state and then open an object because the state is an object and then number which is the one I want to change and then I will just get the state of the number so this dot state dot number plus one and that would get me the state and add one so if I click one two three so it's just c c incrementing by one each time so I hope you have enjoyed this video please consider liking and subscribing to my videos thank you so much